Hey everyone, welcome back to Ebony with Genghis. So wow, what a couple days. Hey, uh, Ebony with the the double punishments on people. Had a video on it uh, yesterday, earlier today. Uh, wanted to go over new information that's coming in. There's a screenshot going around all of Ebony where uh, it's from customer support. I want to show you guys it, see uh, if you think it's real or not. It seems unbelievable. Could be a uh, communication, you know, translation error by Ebony or, uh, you know, their customer service maybe has never played the game before, doesn't know what they're talking about, that sort of stuff. And then also uh, Google accounts are being deleted. So uh, you might want to double link your uh, accounts with a Facebook as well. Uh, inactive Google accounts are being deleted. I'll show you a little bit more on that, a little bit information. And basically, um, let's get to it. So first thing I'm gonna show you is your science, right? And there's some people who are very upset at Ebony if this is true. So if you go into your Alliance of Science, there is science to transport, all right? So you can transport goods to your teammate. If you go into the embassy, you can see here number of times that you can transport a day, the amount you can transport, the amount of taxes. People do science so that they can, uh, you know, transport. And basically, that was kind of a thing that happened a long time ago before uh, people kind of discovered, hey, let's create some alts, family members that attack them. Why pay the fees? And then, you know, uh, that kind of actually led to a lot of peace on servers or at least agreements where, hey, when you're looting your alt, we leave you alone, even if you are a bumble or burn server because everybody needs it. Wow. Now, let's look at... Uh, what happened today? So first thing, I'll go over the Google accounts. So a uh, subscriber sent me this and said, he, he said he lost, did he say he lost five or 10 alts? Lost the account access. Now, obviously, if you're on a BlueStack system, your account is stable. Like it's there as long as, you know, your, your computer doesn't blow up and you don't have to restart again and reload them all. Um, but if you want to switch accounts and your Google account has been deleted, uh, then you're screwed. So this guy seemed to think that it was related to Ebony. Ebony's getting, you know, people's alts, emails linked to it deleted. But I digged a little bit further and uh, it looks like, so let's see here, delete specific. Uh, Google had to delete. Why can't Google will soon delete dormant accounts? So let's look at this. So these are pretty recent. You can look at the dates, May 19th. I saw another one, a little 2023. Basically, Google is deleting old accounts. So it has nothing to do with Ebony. Google is basically just saying uh, accounts that uh, maybe use a lot of the same phone numbers and are inactive, they are cleaning up their system. So it has nothing to do with Ebony. Don't panic, I think you could just create new ones or link them to Facebook, but unfortunately, most people's Facebooks are linked through a Google, so if you lost that, then it's kind of difficult. But anyways, it has nothing to do with Ebony. Let's get to the important stuff. So, this is a very famous email that has been going around everything. Now, do I believe this is real? Uh, I don't know. Some people are saying that it's a Photoshop. Um, Let's look at it. So people are saying, hello, many players are complaining about having their accounts suspended because they sent resources to their alliance members that got zeroed. We are not, this is a question. Are we not allowed to help our alliance members by sending them resources? And then customer support answers, yes, sending resources to alliance members who have been zeroed is not allowed. Thank you for your understanding. Uh, Okay, so first off, do I think it's real? I'm not so sure. And the reason why I say I'm not sure is I have been sent this by like, I don't know, 
15 people and everybody claims this is from someone in their alliance. Like someone in my alliance got this response from customer service. So right there, that's weird to me. It's possible they all did. Uh, or it's just maybe, you know, they're just kind of stretching the truth a bit and someone in their line group or discord group got this. And, you know, they're just kind of saying it's someone they know closer than, than their alliance. But uh, is it true? I don't know. Uh, show you one of my customer service email. So I actually wrote this just a couple days ago. So it's the only one I have because when they close tickets, you can't see them. And you can see that I, you know, I heard people are being compensated in all stars for stuck marches. So, hey, I wasn't victorious. Maybe I could have been if I didn't have zero, zero marches like everybody else. So I asked and, you know, let's uh, just compare these, right? So does the text look the same? kind of looks different um i don't know like this could just be the font because this is from an iphone and maybe this is from a google phone like if i look up top here these are not uh these are not iphone symbols up there so it could just be because of that so right there there's a little bit of difference but uh everything else looks kind of the same like the box here it's all lined up there's no other mistakes i would say that this is probably actually a response from customer service now the other question is does customer service know what they're actually replying to here they might think that sending resources to a teammate is allowing them to attack you like allowing them to loot your alt they don't actually understand hey i'm using the transport system that is by clicking on the account and actually hitting transport. So like what I mean by that is you can go here and you can hit transport and you can send resources. So maybe if they use the word transport, uh, they might've got a different response. I don't know, but if this is true, it's outrageous. Um, I will say this, I will say that about a year and a half ago when they first did their first uh, attack on alts, I had one family member that got hit pretty hard and all it ever did was transport. And the person it transported to, like I used to trade with this guy, resources for stamina, and this was on my other server and it was bubble or burn, and he was a smaller guy and he wasn't comfortable attacking, so I had to transport to him. And that account got hit hard, and so did he for receiving the transports from that account is all that we could figure out as to why he got hit. So. There is kind of, so that right there kind of makes me believe what Evan is saying. Now, uh, a lot of people in the groups are saying, well, I should, not me, but them or anyone who's upset by this should write their, you know, credit cards or their other companies uh, that they, you know, that they purchase through the application stores who do the purchases, the mediums of exchange and say, hey, I paid money for all these research stones and gold to do these sciences and now Ebony's saying they're irrelevant and they'll punish me for it so they should refund me for it and that's kind of true Ebony should <clears throat> Ebony should be issuing refunds and eliminate that part from the game if they don't want transported and take it off but uh i don't know pretty scary thing that it seems like Ebony's just kind of pissed off and they're like the the they're like the teacher who says to the student, because I said so, or the parent who does that, right? But that doesn't make sense. Why don't you just, because I said so, you don't need any other answer. Like that's what it seems how, how Ebony is acting right now, especially if this email is true. It's very scary times. Uh, and I don't see why they'd be acting like this because revenues have never been higher. All Stars just finished and trust me, revenue is so high right now in the game. Or at least it was a week ago. I think it's going to drop a lot with All Stars over. And I guess we're going to see uh, in the coming months, summertime, maybe people have other things to do in life and they just drop the game. So uh, it's going to be very interesting what happens to Ebony here as they... 
it's hard to imagine a business treating their customer base so poorly than what Ebony is right now. So anyways, let me know in the comments uh, anything else you guys know about this sort of stuff. Do you believe that that's a legitimate email from Ebony? And uh, like, subscribe, leave a comment.